And now, is Anthony someone that you're trying No. Okay, then why not? Uh, just the way he looks. Dang. Yeah. Hey, so you do. No, what's your name? And what's your name? Okay, okay. Brittany, how old are you? Three. Uh, 30. Um, I'm a chief of operations at a market. Yes, girl. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm so nervous. I'm so sorry, y'all. And everything. <laughs> now, what are some uh -huh. things like to do for fun? Um, so I hope like part-time um, when I'm not working, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, travel, I like to just be outdoors. Okay. Um, I'm an outdoorsy type of girl. She nice. pretty. But um, yeah, I'm so nervous. <laughs> you got <Nice>. this. <laughs> now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, an alpha man, like someone who can take lead, um, someone, like I said, adventurous, mm -hmm. um, okay. funny. I love like to laugh. Mm -hmm. um, someone like very sportsy. You don't have to play necessarily any sport, but you have to like know mm. about like the game. like. Preferably like football or basketball, but okay. yeah. <laughs> yeah. And now what are some of your deal breakers? Um, communication, like if you don't know how to, you know, be receptive and actually communicate like your feelings. Mm -hmm. Like if you, for example, if you're feeling um, mad about something or upset, like I would want you to tell me what it is instead yeah. of like keeping it in. Um, someone who's not confident. Mm -hmm. I need like a confident person. I don't hey, want to keep like kind of like, I don't mind, you know, up. giving you your, your light and like, you know, helping you build that confidence, but yeah. you kind of have to have, it have that. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Uh, All right. So we did get a couple of pop balloons. Let's go on over there and see why they ended up popping. Okay. Let's start with your I name like and it. age. She cool. My name is Anthony and I'm 29. And Anthony, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, I'm just have to say off of initial attraction. Mm. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> and now is Anthony someone that you're trying? No. Okay. And why not? Uh, just the way he looks. Dang. Yeah. Oh my God. And then we did get another pop down here. Your name and age? My name is Seiku and I'm 30. And Seiku, why'd you end up popping your balloon? She's not necessarily my type. She's beautiful. She give me auntie vibes, though. Mm. That's why I pop. But she's a beautiful woman, though. Okay, what? okay got it. You now, is uh, Seiku someone? 30, like you aunt. Kind of. Kind okay. of. <laughs> but why give auntie vibes? Um, you just, I, it's your tone and your voice. It's, it's like stern. Like, you give me auntie vibes. Where are you from? I'm from Jersey. And I give auntie vibes. Okay. Hi. Hi. No, you good. You good. Okay. My Let's fault. go on over yeah, here. Yeah. Your name and age. I'm Lou, 33. And Lou, why'd you end up popping your balloon? I think she's attractive. I like some of her hobbies, but it's just not my type. Mm. No, is he like, someone that's your type? No. Okay, and why not? She, she got a little meat on her bones, but I be liking that though. I be liking like a little stomach pouch and you know what I'm saying? A little meat on her arms and stuff. I like, you know what I mean? I like, I, shoot, I don't got no type. Boy. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. oh, the ball hit you. Lost all the bodies. <laughs> all right, thank you, Lou. <laughs> Dang. Let's head on back. Oh, sorry, y'all. Okay. Sorry, y'all. You gonna get a match, boy? All right, your, <laughs> your name and age. Left, I got, hey, my name is Robert. I'm 29. I got PTSD from being bald, man. <laughs> oh <laughs> damn. What? No, no, but uh. Oh. Other, outside of that remark, I love everything about you. Oh, thank you. Yeah. And you have a very strong presence. Thank and, you. you know, yeah. I can, not auntie, right? Not auntie. Oh, no, I don't know what you're talking about. No, no. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so you no. pop because the bald statement. Tell something yeah, about that. You know, hey, sometimes you just can't control it. So. <laughs> okay, so obviously I know you just said you're not a fan of bald. So is he someone that's your type? Actually, you're actually like really cute. Like oh. I really find you attractive. I appreciate like, it. Could have kept the balloon. Even you though know. I did say the bald head, like I mean, at the end of the day, you know, like it's not like a big deal break. You have some bald, and then actually, like I said, you're attractive. So. I appreciate it. Yeah. I appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Robert, you, said you get a pass on the bald. I get a pass on the bald. Mm. She's spilling it on you. Give me my balloon back, man. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Okay. Let's get that balloon back. Okay. Okay. Got it. Okay. We'll be back for you then. Okay. Let's he said he back loved anything way. about her. Name and age? Kendall 28. Kendall, why did we end up popping our balloon? It's the same. The ball, you know. You're not bald. You know, bald, it's lining bro. up a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Um, but other than that, she had great energy. Uh, I love hooping too. So, and I'm very competitive as well. Yeah, I'm uh, with sports. So, yeah. Got it. Now, is Kendall someone that you're talking Yeah, no, he's attractive. I don't see the bald, though. I'm confused on him. <laughs> Let's see. Tilt down. Maybe slow, we're missing slow, it. Slow. <laughs> oh, he going bald. He's he going to be bald one day. He just know it. <laughs> <laughs> he playing in the head. Okay. All right, Kendall. And I think we just got to pop down there. Let's head on over there. Oh, they got All right. Let's get your Oh, they got a few balloons. My name's Agnel. I'm 29. And Agnel, why'd you end up popping your balloon? I was looking at how she responded to how the other dudes were, you know, critiquing. And I just didn't like it. She seems like she's mean. She's kind of mm. concealing it a little bit. But she from yeah, up north. So you can tell. Bro. I just didn't like how she, she gotta be. reacted a little bit. So. Okay. So you say you're getting like. 
that she's like undercover me? Yeah, no, nah, like <laughs> it, it just seems like she would be very argumentative. Mm. What do you think about that? <laughs> I disagree, but I don't want to say too much because I might be argumentative. So. <laughs> all right, all right. It's a okay. scene, but it's okay. It's all, it's all right. right. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's head on back. Man, so we have. Whoa. Stop Four walking bad. Left on popped. Let's go ahead and ask these remaining guys a question. Whatever question you may have. For um, hmm. I don't want to be like the typical, you know, like main general question. So, um, if you had to describe, well, if you had to choose a superhero that describes mm. the characteristics or who you guys are, uh, what would it be? Well, who would it be, and Wait, why? Mm, that's a little different. Look at them thinking. <laughs> describe a superhero. Okay, let's start here. Uh, Frozone. Frozone. Yeah. My Why? super suit, man. <laughs> Where's my super suit? Well, you know, he's a family oh, guy. Oh, know. Okay. You know, he's willing to go and risk Where's his life for the, for the city, for the people. Yeah, that was He's hard. black, you know what I mean? So, yeah. yeah I mean, there's not a lot of black superheroes. And if you say uh, Black Panther, that's a cliche. So. Mm. Black Panther. Like, uh, okay. So, yes. So Frozone. Frozone. Ooh, what superhero y'all be? I ain't gonna lie. Let's go over here. Your name and age, uh, man. So, what superhero would you be? I don't know. My name is Brian, and I'm 33. Mm. Um... I probably go with the Flash. I'm really addicted to saving time. I get a lot done in a short <laughs> amount of time, and oh, he's smart. It's it's kind of my thing. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. Okay, let's go over here. Your name and age, and Hello, what superhero? What would you be? Jason. I'm 28, and I'm I would say Mbaku, leader of the Jabadi. What? That's yeah. Different. I was. That's yeah. different. Why? Um, his personality is very similar wow. to mine. Um, if you've seen Black Panther, mm -hmm. he's very, uh, very caring of his community. Mm -hmm. Very, like, kind of alpha type, yeah. very, like, brawler kind of type. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like I resemble that oh, a lot. Yeah. yeah, that's what I would choose. That's cool. That's a dope yeah. cool. Different. All right, let's go over here. Uh, name and age. And oh, no. Question. My name is Cliff, and I'm 31 years old. Um, superhero, I'll be, uh, say, Static Shock. Oh, and I say cool. Static Shock because, yeah, you know, Dreads, people. Me, Locks, Fun. You know, back in the day, that was like one of the shows growing, growing up. up. Yeah, yeah, growing yeah. up watching. So Static Shock, that was me. I feel like that was me, that character. That was fun, energetic, you know, just good for the kids. You know, someone African-American, too, as well, you know, mm -hmm. with Locke. So that was something that we can watch growing up. So I feel like Static Shock was me. So hey. like that answer. <laughs> All right, let's head on back. And it is time to pop a balloon. Out of these four guys, I'm going to have you pop one balloon. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then, so let me go ahead and hand you a pick. There you go. Thank you. Just go ahead and pop that one. Right now, right? Yeah, okay. whenever you're ready. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so why do we end up no popping flash, this? No um, I like everything that you said. Like, your answers were very, very dope. Um, it's the fit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's what's up with the fit? Um, it might be the, the shirt. The pants. It, I don't, it might be I, the I'm shirt. Not, I don't like them. The, the shirt with the cut. Where are you from again? Orlando. Orlando? Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah. I just, yeah. Like I said, the shirt, the pants. Uh, it's, it's the plaid with the flowers. I don't know. It's like plaid and then symbols. And then he, the Raptor 7s. That is a little crazy symbol. Grab the seven heart though. Tight up, really, really tight, like you're about to run somewhere. But he should just have like a black shirt on, black t-shirt. Yeah, you just take a flash on me. <laughs> or a black collar shirt or something. So. Okay. So Brian, why'd you have your balloon unpopped? Um, I wanted to hear more about her. She's beautiful uh, as well. Um, she's got a good career also. So. Thank you. Yeah. Definitely. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, go ahead and ask these guys another question. Um. Hmm. I don't know, y'all. The superhero if thing. If you were on. I probably say like Batman, because I'm more like to myself, you feel me? I feel like Batman to himself, feel me? Like, people don't really know what's going on with Batman. I feel like Batman. I say Batman. On a vacation, what are three main things that you would like to do? I like Wolverine, too. Or like, like have to do. Okay, let's start. And I like the whole. All right, let's start here. It's a hard question. Uh, <clears throat> my name is Cliff, 31. Um, so, vacation, uh, I like to plan stuff. So, the first thing I go, uh, I like to being the major of the city, so that's the heart of the city for me. So then I like to do spontaneous stuff, like I like to go chill at the beach or do stuff that's, um, that city is known for, that country is known for. So like, for instance, like Brazil, I went to uh, the Sugarloaf Mountain and stuff like that. So I like to plan, you know, my trips. Mm -hmm. So I like to do fun things that's in whatever country it is. And then I also like okay. to, you know, sightsee, go, you know, if it's a football, soccer game. So I just like to explore anything that I can in that city in, the, in that time. And I like to give myself a week so, you know, I can do everything I can do. So that's pretty much, you know, plan accordingly, really. So I'd like to do a lot of things like eat, travel, you okay, know, go okay, sightsee, man. do everything, <laughs> hike in it, whatever I can do. I do it all. So that's my three things, though. Yeah, yeah, he like her. I ain't gonna lie, he like her. All right, what the things you doing? Somebody all yapping, they Number like her. one. Some. Check out all the local good food spots. I'm a big foodie, um, but specifically, I like to find the local spots, the yeah, things that are not like 
things I can get in another part of the world, but like specific to their place. So get in with the locals, see what they like, that kind of thing, ask questions. Um, of course, sightsee, um, maybe go high, take a hike, sunsets, different things like that, see what the city has to offer. Um, and then I'm, I love anything with water. So boat, boat ride, whatever it is, just kind of get out in the water. Yeah, so I've got to do that. And our last guy. Awesome. So uh, that's a great question, by the way. Thank you. So the first thing I would like to do is immerse myself in the city and the culture. And I particularly, um, I like a schedule, but I like to, when I go on trips to be spontaneous and um, just go around, talk to the locals, like the other gentleman said, figure out, you know, what are some good spots to eat at, some local places to listen to live music, depending on the region. Um, and then also, you know, from there, I mean, have you and I time, you know? So, you know, you just- want to define uh, where you and I time is? <laughs> let the imagination run on that one. <laughs> but, uh, I, you know, and just make it a magical and, and spiritual and memorable trip, you know, that, because in this life, not a lot of people take time to really appreciate the little things, right? Well, and just be in the moment. He saved yeah, so it. that's the first thing I would do is just be in the moment with my partner. Okay. Woo! She ain't like that. that in <laughs> okay, so we do she have three guys left. Hit. Let me go ahead and have you ask them another question. Um, do any of you guys have kids? Just okay, like... how many? Let's go down there. All right, how many kids do you have? I have one son. I was married for three years, and yes, I have one son. He's and how old is your son? He just turned three. Mm. Are kids a deal breaker for you? Kids are, kids are definitely yeah, a deal breaker. I'm so sorry. Yeah. All right, so Jason, why did you have to do unpops for her? Find somebody I love her energy. Kids. She's beautiful. Um, everything she said aligned with, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. absolutely. Thank you. Mm -hmm. She's cool. She actually pretty cool, back. man. I ain't gonna lie. All right, and then you said you're from she ain't doing too New York. Much. New York. Brooklyn, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I knew she was from so New York, bro. I'm gonna ask this because everybody always want to throw this out in the air. Mm -hmm. Is long distance... Okay with either of you guys. Let's start over here. No, I, I can't do a lot that long. Mm. It's I'm a very physical person and I like to be with my partner a lot a lot of the time. You okay. need um, if it was just a little bit closer, you know, I could maybe, Somebody maybe I could convince you to move to Arizona. Oh, you're from Arizona. I'm from Arizona. Okay. Mm. It's funny, I actually want to move to Phoenix, Arizona, oh, but okay. I, don't, I don't know yet. I don't know yet. But okay. Yeah, it's a thought. Yeah, because the East Coast is kind of crazy. Yeah, yeah that's, that's what I heard. East Coast is crazy, you know, bro. Keep my butt here in the sunny side <laughs> and the sunny state. Um, but yes, I, I don't, if it was a little bit closer, I would make an exception. Okay. I feel like you can, you can pop if but, you want to, but you can just pop it. Uh, <laughs> All right, and then let's wow. go down here and see if he's okay with the distance. Where are you actually at? Uh, Las Vegas. Oh, Vegas, and how are you at the that's not a problem with me. Well, look, he don't care. He try to go crazy. Hey, well then. Any final questions? He did all that yapping. Um, he don't care. I feel like you had to describe yourself better. using like one word and why. Inspiring. Inspiring. Why? Mm. Um, just the, the things that I do in my life. Um, very adventurous. Scuba diving. Um, I also cycle. Um, I like to travel internationally. I've been in Brazil, Italy. So I just, I'm a very inspiring person. So mm. that's one word I okay. describe myself. Mm -hmm. And where do you, where do you, oh, you said Vegas. Um, what do you do for work? I'm a project manager for a construction company. And how old are you again, you said? 31. 31. You got no kids? I don't got no kids. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with you? She's trying to find something. She's trying to find something. Um, <laughs> would you like to say you're like chill? I'm very chill. Chill. Because I'm like, I'm not loud or anything, but I am like really goofy and I like to laugh and I like to like joke a lot. Oh, I'm goofy too. Trust me. I'm goofy. I'm funny too. But I'm chill too. I can be chill too. Okay. I'm both. Okay. I feel like the ball dude was better, bro. I, don't know, I can still ask more questions. Or no, y'all no, on time? Let me, let me bring y'all back up here. Come <laughs> she on, Cliff. Ask, boy. <laughs> she should want the ball dude. Move All right, y'all. Start fresh. Are we good? Any other questions? I'm good. She, oh, sorry. she, she <laughs> not. She <laughs> not sure. She not sure. So, um, she not sure. He need a pop. He just gets very calm. So like, I'm trying to just figure out like if he like not calm as far as like just like laid back, but like a little bit boring. So I'm just trying to figure mm. out, and I don't mean disrespect, mm. but I'm just trying to figure out if. Pop that. Our energy match, you know? Pop it. I'm trying to figure out what other question to ask to like resemble that. that. And I'm kind of stuck with that. Pop it. Bro. All right. Well, then with that being said, Cliff, is it a yes for you? It's a yes for me. And is it a yes for you for him? No. I'm going to say you no. Should. But don't waste your time. Okay. All right. Sorry. Okay. We'll have he you head on back, Cliff. Simped. Thank you. He was shipping. All right. Well, he that is all too. the balloons. <laughs>
popped. But we do thank you so much for coming on. Let's give it up for her, guys. Yeah. Right. Thank you. It was the ball, dude. The ball, dude. It was the match, man. It don't make sense to pick the Las Vegas dude if you're not going to pick the ball, dude. Simple. Eventually, you're going to move to Las Vegas. You say you thinking about moving to Arizona anyway. I don't understand why she... I don't understand why they did that. Dang. That, that seemed like that was the match for sure. They had the chemistry and everything. I don't know. He ain't really showing too much personality, so she just assumed he born. That's what happens, bro. Girl, not really interested with you. Good thing she did pop, though. I ain't gonna lie. Because that would have been wasted time, man. I don't know. I I don't appreciate women wasting men time out here. Vice versa. Simple. So, if you ain't really into somebody, just pop or don't even talk to them. Don't even waste their time, man. So, that's how that's how hearts get broken out here. I, get, I hope he learn from this shit, bruh. If a girl not interested in you, bruh, don't be forcing it, bruh. She gonna say all that and you still gonna say it's a yes. <laughs> <laughs> he crazy. This your boy Kevin, man. Comment down below how y'all feel about the situation. I mess with her. I, I think she cool. I don't know. Maybe she uh running from a good dude, man. The bald dude just seemed like he was, he was well for her. And maybe she, you know what I'm saying? Women, women be afraid of commitment and, and afraid to go with the good dude or, or the dude that they supposed to be with. Simple. Because they just used to so many dudes. Just toxic negativity. You know, all that extra stuff. It's your boy Kevin, man. Comment down below how y'all feel about the situation. I'm going to see y'all tomorrow check out my second channel everything kevo too i'm about to record a video as soon as i get this one up i promise oh god i am what